we're back. My next guest is one of the greatest table tennis players in the world. Here he is in action. Please welcome Nick Kong. King Kong, Barney Reed. Barney, thanks for being here. Thanks for having Good me. Good to have you. I don't think people realize, uh, ping pong is huge uh, worldwide. This is an Olympic sport. Uh, yeah, it's the second most popular sport in the world behind soccer. Right, and, 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 and you play extreme ping pong, which just kind of sounds funny, but it shouldn't. <laughs> I mean, extreme ping pong meaning you just take it to the edge, is that right? You... Uh, well, the ball can travel anywhere between 30 to 70 miles an hour. It's right. like hitting a Nolan Ryan fastball with only nine feet apart. Because you're, you're much closer together. Right. And, and you feel the sport has changed a lot over time, right? It's, that it's people evolving. May, people in America especially may not have the right appreciation for what ping pong has become. Um, at, at this time, the general public has the concept of ping pong being a basement sport or a garage sport. But with it being an Olympic sport in 1988, we're trying to kill or spin, and the new extreme table tennis that's being shown on ESPN is trying to show the general public that it's actually a sport where the athletes train anywhere between six to eight hours a day. Do you think it hurts the sport being taken seriously that it's called ping pong by a lot of people? Uh, I'm serious, like, you know, what do you do? Ping pong, you know, that you don't like the term ping pong. Is that true? Well, Most aficionados don't like that term. It generalizes the sport with a basement or garage. Um, right. It doesn't show it as an athletic sport where the athletes actually train. Right, right. So if you could change the name to Murder Ball, <laughs> you'd be happier. Hey, you know? It sounds better. Right. Um, does everybody thinks everybody kind of thinks they're good at, at at table tennis, ping pong? Everybody. I mean, you could take the the sort of the fattest slob in the world sitting on a couch who never does anything, and he'd probably be like, I'm great at ping pong. Is in, that true? People think they're better than they are? Yeah, in, in their ping pong world, they're awesome because for them, they just stand there and they think this is ping pong. They don't realize that you actually have to move and the physical that's involved. What you just did was what I do, pretty much. I stay still and I just go, eh, yeah, and, but you, uh, you, you have and I make that sound, I go, eh. <laughs> Like you, you have a good physique for table tennis, though. A, a good, a, a good physique. I like, you should have stopped at good physique. <laughs> I'm like, thanks. That's the, see, I have a good physique for table tennis. Thank you. <laughs> what does that mean? Uh, do, what, what about my body is, uh, and just go for it. You, you have speed, you don't have bulk. Because if you're bulk, you lose the speed and the quickness. So you think I'm like a wiry cat is yeah, what you're you saying. Yeah, you have cat-like reflexes. I'm like here and then I'm over there, right? Watch, check this out, I'm here and then I'm over here. Did you see that happen? You didn't even see was that, that happen. Was that, was that a two step that or a one happened. step? That just happened, that was one step and I was over there. Gotcha. So it's wiring, it's good that I haven't, I don't have too much muscle mass. Right. I have right. a lot of muscle mass, but not too much. Right. And that movement was very good. You're actually gonna be pretty quick here. I gotta what watch out What about the fact you. that I'm long? People don't realize how long and lanky I am. <laughs> is, that, is that something that's, is that good that I'm long? Like I, I can cover a lot of area. I think that's your uniqueness about you. That's your style. All right. We're gonna, uh, we're gonna, why don't you get me in a position? We're gonna do this. Okay. Let's do this. All right, grab the paddle. Adam, you wanna come do this too? Adam, come on over. Help me play. Oh, 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 <laughs> Show us what to do. Okay, you guys wanna get ready to play? All right, what do we do? Okay, we're First, right you here. gotta bend your knees. Just kinda stick your butt out. <laughs> okay, you guys ready? Now, this now, is are you holding it the right way? Okay. Yeah, you guys are holding it fine. Oh, this is unlike tennis and table tennis. You got gonna, you know, come on. Yeah, take your jacket off. Stay a while, Adam. Stay oh, a while. Okay. Oh, I got, I got oh, He's got his microphone on oh, there. Okay, He's got okay. microphone. I'm microphones sorry. Microphones in sorry, there. Okay. Technology hasn't improved. Oh, oh nice. Baby. Oh, look at this. I'm You're in, in the, trouble. Yeah, Coney. All right, we got the new <laughs> Olympic doubles team here. I said, hi! I said, hi! His fault. It was his fault. I saw it. <laughs> it was sort of more towards your area of this side. <laughs> Sorry, I get crazy when I play sports. <laughs> now you can do, you can put crazy spins on it too, can't yes. you? Oh, oh yeah. You, you want you spin? want some spin? spin yeah. Spin is out. Oh boy. Oh my yeah, God! Look at that. That's a problem. <laughs> yeah. Try that again. I bet I can return you take that. that one, Maybe. Cody. <laughs> <laughs> well, ah! There is no way to return that. Yes, it is. Aim over here. Yeah, go ahead. Aim there. Aim okay. The, it's there. mathematics. It's math, math. Don't yell at me. Oh. Ah. It's closer. It's in the way. Hold that with that. Hold that with that. Hold that. too hard. Stop. You're a, you. What are you doing? <laughs> I did that. I'm on you, your side. You jiggled the table. <laughs> he, he's your teammate, man. We're together. Come on. Yeah, come on. I'm come your on. teammate. I like you. Uh, right. I can't. It's just too spinning. I can't. Settle you try. Down. You try. Yeah. All right. <laughs> I'll give you an easy one. Just hit it. Just hit it. Time, yes. That was crazy. 
crazy. I'm not worthy. Did you see that? <laughs> I do it all, baby. It's clear to me now. And we, were, and we were talking before, and I'm like, yeah, you said, have you, you asked me, have you played before? And I'm like, I don't really play much. And I'm like, yeah, I don't really play at all. <laughs> they Every night, in the movie? I'm in my house. Yeah. <laughs> That was no, very that was nice. Awesome, that was though. very Those nice. Insane. All right. Well, listen. We're gonna wrap this thing up. Thank you so much for being it's here, though. That was incredible. Barney me. Reed is yeah, gonna be. Uh, uh, <laughs> 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 He's so pumped up I'm now. I'm sorry. I got it right on there. Yeah, yeah, Barney. Yeah, uh, Barney. Thanks, Barney. Barney Reed is gonna be an ambassador at the Killer Spin Extreme Table Tennis, not oh, Ping cool. Pong Championship, this That's Sunday. Excellent. You've got to settle down. <laughs> Oh, this is great. Now, now you're all into ping pong now. <laughs> this is Sunday at Mohegan Sun in Connecticut. Barney Reed, everybody. We'll be right back. <laughs>a huge sweat in that last segment, so sorry, ladies. This just has to happen. Uh, that's our show. I do want to thank my guests. Oh, good. Yeah, very good luck at that. I want to thank my guests. You tried. Uh, Barney Reed, thanks so much. Good luck to you, sir. Thanks a lot. Hey, everybody. Uh, the movie's The Longest Yard. Go check it out. It's really good. Adam Sandler, everybody. He's a man. Right, Max Weinberg, Max Weinberg, send to the last call. Start again. what should today's college graduates expect in the future? In the future? Yeah. Just expect a lot of hard work and plenty of competition and, of course, the coming robot war. <laughs> robot war? I'm not going to lie to you. Many of you students will die in the robot war. <laughs> Those that survive will have to breed with their sisters. Oh, my God. <laughs> It will be a bittersweet chore. For God's sakes. Arnold, listen, we're, out of, we're almost out of time. Do you have any real advice for graduates out there? Uh, yeah, yeah, you young people have a mission. You must go out into the world and find the less fortunate people, the poor and needy, and help them by handing out DVD copies of my Smash Henry Harmony Classic. Do you all the day? Oh, for God. Arnold. <laughs> Arnold, why? Why, Arnold? Let me explain. You listen to me. If you give a man a jingle, he'll jingle for one day. But if you teach that man to jingle, then that man will jingle all day. Oh, for God's sakes, Governor Arnold Schwarzenegger.